Hey guys, it's Oak. I'm back again with another video. This time I will show you how to create a spam key uh, using Logitech's G Hub. Uh, this will work if you have uh, Logitech peripherals, uh, such as I have the G502 Hero mouse, uh, but it also work if you have a keyboard that will allow the uh, keys to be remapped, and also some headsets, believe it or not. But regardless, uh, here we go. So first of all, you would just open up Logitech's G Hub. You can see I just have the 502 Hero. Uh, you'll click on your mouse. It's going to have all sorts of different commands for your buttons. Uh, all we're looking at today is the macros. So you can see I, I preemptively made one just to make sure that I could show you. I'm going to go ahead and delete it. Uh, but we are going to create a new macro. So we're going to name it spam key. And what we want it to do is we want it to repeat while holding. So you click that option. Now you click start now, then you record your keystroke. I'm going to use the left bracket and then I'm going to stop my recording. Uh, the standard delay says 50 milliseconds. We're going to make it longer than that since 50 milliseconds is quite a bit faster than what would humanly be possible. So uh, we'll go ahead and make it 240 milliseconds and then click save. Now we want to assign it to a key. So I like to assign these two buttons here. So I'm going to put it on the forward key. So the way we do that is I would just drag it from here to the forward button. And that's it. Uh, it's set up. So we'll demonstrate it. I'll just open up notepad and I'll hold down the spam key. And there you go. It's spamming the key. So, um, as I've said previously, uh, your milliseconds is highly subjective, so just use what works best for you. Um, I would not suggest going any faster than what is humanly possible. So, if you liked the video, hit the like button. Uh, be sure to subscribe and uh, comment down below. But thank you very much, and have a great day.